I've been looking forward to this topic. This is going to be specifically for Coachella. Um, I want to do this another time. This is going to be just kind of like a test run. But hopefully when the when when there's like people in the chat, I will want people like, oh, Kyle, can you make a fit for me? And then we'll we'll do that. So um, we'll what I'll do is like I'll give you my my thought process into picking an outfit. Uh, and then we'll just online shop for a little bit. We'll we'll build it ourselves, and then like people will be like, oh, uh, my budget is this much, and then we'll we'll find out how to work within that budget, man. Because I want people to, bro, like clothes is where I get my confidence, and if I can encourage people, empower people to do the same, fucking great. Clothes don't have to be where you get your confidence, but it helps me. And if you want to try it out for yourself, fucking do it. Yeah, man. I love me my clothes, motherfucker. Like I said, man, put it, being able to put my favorite clothes on hangers and give them their old space, bro, that was a game changer for me. That shit makes me so happy. I like to just look at my clothes. Fucking, I didn't grow up with a dryer. I grew up hang drying everything, and that was my favorite parts. I would put the colors here, and then the whites, and then the darks, and I would just look at them, dude, in like a fucking succession of fucking colors. Of, uh... An ombre of rainbow to monochrome. It was fucking crazy. Clothes mean a lot to me. My my one of my dreams. I want people to go to a Kyle from work show. I said this on stream before, but like they hit up their friends like, hey bro, hey bro, I just got something from that new babe drop, bro. I'm gonna go see go uh, wear it to Kyle from work. They're like, oh shit, bro, you're gonna call from work. Oh, let me see that shit. Oh, I'm gonna dress up with you too, bro. The same way that people pick an outfit out for Coachella, I want people to pick an outfit for my shows. You know what I mean? I mean that's that's a big ass because like Coachella is like one of the biggest things of the year like if I were to go like to a concert you know what I mean just I want an outfit picked I want people to be hitting each other up hey what are you gonna wear oh shit that's lit I want that that is a big part of community bro and the clothes you wear make a statement bro like even if you don't care about what clothes you wear that's a statement and that's completely fine I feel like clothes are the fucking um you could tell a lot from a person. I like big colors and loud fucking prints. I've been wearing more basic lately, but I'm, I'm shooting my um, my special on May 12th. It's called a family film. Proceeds from ticket sales will be donated to promote health, mental wellness, and diversity in the LGBTQ community here in the Bay Area. We're going to be featuring Noah Jones, this great fucking comedian who holds a, uh, one of my favorite open mics in San Jose. And uh, he's gonna be my MC. He's a funny ass motherfucker. This fool really pulled up. I was doing stand up at his mic, and he pulled up ass cheeks out in a fucking hospital gown. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Anyway, um, what was I gonna say? Anyways, yeah, please go get a ticket. You can scan the QR code. I also have it on, on my stream right now. And um, yeah, man, so prices will go up for my show on April 15th. It's just gonna go up to $12. Again, the money's gonna go to fucking A. The money's gonna go to the uh, LGBT community here in here in the San Jose. Oh no, my candle blew out. It's okay. Uh, let's, let's fucking get to it, bro. Just so you know, I know what I'm talking about. Let me show you the past Tuchella fit. Come on. Oh, I was so fucking fat this year. God damn it. Oh, this one was hard. Uh, <laughs> this was in uh, Flogna 2019. I, uh, this is when I started playing with makeup, actually. I have one blue eye, one yellow eye. You can't really tell from this. It kind of came out a little weird, but I remember... <laughs> my, uh, my homie, the one that's trying to get the Mara Mara fruit, uh, he's, uh, his niece was just like, you're like a pretty princess. When I was doing my makeup, I was like, thank you, baby. <laughs> that's hella funny. Anyways, um, open shirt, open shirt at the festival fucking cannot be done always, bro. Got my Tanjiro, man. This is like, yeah, season one just finished around this time, right? Oh, shit. So, yeah, man. Got some rolled up, rolled up fucking pants, bro. I got palace, tall palace socks and some bape slides. Bape times, sweet coke. A little bit of jewelry, never hurt anyone, bro. And, um, yeah, dude. These are my homies. Also, while we're on it, if y'all ever get one of these Howries from motherfucking Demon Slayer, goddamn, they are warm as fuck. <laughs> this is another year with the squad. Let me see how that comes up. But yeah, man, clothes are my favorite fucking thing, man. Uh, as you can see, I got like a white fanny pack. Fanny packs were fucking in this year, bandana. This crown... That's my Coachella crown, bro. That's my Coachella crown. Fucking, they do this thing where um, if you go to the market, 
That's what I like. Dude, Coachella is just like a home fucking built community. I love it. You get an address and shit. Um, what a, what I got on this? I got the crown because I got it in like a spin the wheel. What do you get? I got a flower crown from there. I got flower. These are like rounded out glasses. Um, we need to go like way the fuck in the beginning for this because this is some shit way in the beginning. See, these are the glasses I'm talking about with the rings inside. I remember when I. <laughs> I didn't even know he recorded this, bro. I was fucked up. What is this? Glass animals? I'm pulling that shit. Wee! I, I like to low key cosplay at festivals, just like in the lowest key. Like, I. I my style is like hype, streetwear times cosplay. Any other fits I want to show you? I'm a short shorts king, bro. Like, fucking, I got these thick-ass thighs that I like to show off and shit. And, uh, all right. Uh, so let's do the step-by-step -step process on how I pick a fit. First of all, let's look at the, the weather in Indio. That's, that's my first step. Look at the weather because personally for me, I'm confident in my clothes, but I have to be comfortable. You know what I mean? I'm not comfortable. I'm like, you're going to sweat in Coachella. It's a, it's a fucking desert. But whatever I could do to minimize that, like, I'm not going to fucking wear pants. For sure. Oh, let's go Indio, California. Because we, we want to know what we're getting in, getting ourselves into. Now, hi, eight. Oh, wow. That's actually not bad. 10 miles per hour. Um, Interesting. Fuck, maybe I should have went. So, day zero would be Thursday. Like I said, um, uh, let's open up the lineup. Cool. Um, what's the word? So day zero would be a Thursday. Again, we're going to pull up, set up all our shit. We'll pregame a little bit. And then day one will be that Friday. Friday, we're looking at 86, 86 degrees. Damn, that's not even bad, bro. We're not even hitting the high hundreds. We hit like 104 and shit when I went... Bro, man, and shout out for everyone that wears makeup because that shit is way too fucking hot, bro. I did, uh, that one year I was fucking around with makeup. I only did it for one day. Be I had brought enough and I had planned my makeup for the next couple days, but I was like, this is too fucking hot. I don't want to do this shit. And I want to touch my face when it's hot. I want to go like this without having to fucking trip, you know? Anyway, um, yeah, man. So we're looking at high 80s, low 50s at, or mid 50s at night. That's looking real good. Mostly sunny. Uh, so there's going to be a touch of clouds. Wind doesn't look like it's that bad. I don't know what... Is 10 miles per hour fast? How fast should wind be? How fast should wind be? <laughs> okay, so there's a gentle breeze. So there's gonna be a gentle breeze. So what we're looking at is tank top weather. Uh, another thing you could do, look at the lineup. Who are you gonna see in day one, two, and three that you wanna uh, think for? Let's say we're going to Doja Cat. What do you wanna wear for Doja Cat, bro? <laughs> uh, yeah, man. Turning to the desert Swedish house mafia. I feel like let's do a let's do a day one fit. I made this joke. If you uh, had a significant other and that's uh, going to cella, you are to a certain extent you are that person's accessory. I made this one myself actually. My oh, um, the the inspiration for this was actually from Demi Sutra. The adult star, the adult film star, uh, she posted a fucking, I think she was getting ready for the uh, uh, adult mu mu movie AMVs, adult move AFVs, America's Family's Home Videos, adult film a AMAs, uh, whatever the fucking, um, hey baby, whatever the, the award show for porn is. Anyways, she was going for it. And uh, this is my, uh, this is the one that I did uh, based on Frank. See that? And then here I am in the tent. <laughs> also, shout out to anyone that wears a fucking skirt. This bitch has no pockets. I was I was doing that shit where you gotta fucking put the <laughs> pop I had a pop socket in my phone. I put the pop socket out, put the phone in my waist like that, and I just had to, you know, so it stays on the fucking pocket. On the chains. Always a good life. If you want to go big chains, if you want to go little chains, completely up to you, motherfucking.
Water pack. Always keep. I like being the water boy personally. Anyways. Um, so we got like 20 minutes left on stream. Let's do this, bro. So what I want to do for day one, um, let's start with the anime fits because what I want to do is spoiler alert, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, one piece gear five. This is what we're going for. This is going to be the inspo right here. Uh, <laughs> Shout out One Piece. This shit is going down right now, bro. Um, in the Wano arc, bro. Is this Snake Man? No, this isn't Snake Man. I'm, I didn't... I'm not caught up with the manga, but I, I watched videos ahead of time. So this is what... This is what we're... Uh, this is our inspo. So we're going to have to find a way to get the long sleeve, the white hanging, the yellows. Um, yeah, man. Where do we want to start? Uh... Let's start with the... Oh, shit. We could just go straight Birk... We'll, we'll go from the bottom up. We'll go from the bottom up. We'll go straight Birkenstocks. Let's get some Birks. Birkenstocks. Or should we go like... Should we do one budget fit and one flex fit? Does that sound fun? Let's do that. Okay. So let's get the... Um, let's just get the basic ones. We'll get the Birkenstocks and then we'll go Gucci... Uh, sandals, men. Why not? <laughs> Why not pull up in these at the cellos, bro? We're only talking hypothetical. I mean, the Birkenstocks will be lit for it, but... Hmm, I get a little Gucci poo, you know what I'm saying? So we'll get, we'll do that for the, for the feats. Alright, let's look at here. Because what we have is, uh, look, like how I was saying earlier, like you want to look at the lines. Your vertical lines and your horizontal lines, diagonals, etc. You can see right here in the, in the pants, Luffy has uh, a line right here, a horizontal line that'll be um, the fucking, the ends of his pants, right? So that's line one. Let's go on the bottom. And also, I have no fashion experience. This is just off my fucking um, experiences, how I dress and shit. Line two would be the waistband, and then line three, and then, and then a hat in line four. Oh, shit. I need a... How, how are we gonna get, gonna get the Mugiwara in this bitch, man? How are we gonna get the straw hat in it? Anyways, well, I want to find a way to make this X work, too. From uh, uh, I, Aokino. Aokino? I, Aikino? I don't know how to spell or say words. Akaino. Akaino. Thank you for coming. Sorry. Thank you for coming through and sharing a YouTube video. What do we got here? Alright, I got Rick rolled, but it's okay. I want to find a way to get this, this cloud across a uh, white sash. Here's the thing too, because you... We, like... You could easily say like, oh, let's just get like a blanket or something to drape over, but, uh, actually, no, 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 no. What's it called? A drape, uh, neck wear. That's not what I want. Not a fucking gator. <laughs> um, what I'm looking for is something that has this like very, um, East Asian fucking look with the clouds and the swirls and the spirals. If I could get that into a drape, something like, ah, fuck, that's a good example. Not like this, but like kind of like this, like thinner. I want like a, a, like a chiffon, you know what I mean? Something real airy, something like this, but like I want to print on it. We could also just, this is just a regular ass scarf. Oh, it's a regular ass scarf. Too warm. We could just put chiffon head scarf. Let's try that. There we go. Something like this, where you can... Not an ascot. Not polka dots. There we go. Oh, wait, 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 no, no, no. I take it back, I take it back. This is the one. This is the one I'm looking for. Yeah, so we're gonna get this real, like, chiff the way chiffon is, it's gonna be real see-through. It's gonna be real, real light. And then we could also just drape it around the shoulders. Is this... Am I appropriating right now? Y'all let me know if I'm appropriating. 
We'll keep this to the side. This we're gonna get the drape. Let's see if we can get something with that cloud design on it. Cause I'm not gonna. Cause if anything, we could just draw it ourselves. It's not a big deal. Just big squirrels gets big squirrels. Big squirrels get a sharpie. But anyway, uh, let's do that. All right, cool. Now, honestly, do you know what would be cool for that X? R.I.P. the boy, bro. <laughs> Shout out Virgil. Um, I'm gonna get this. Oh yeah, that's perfect for Luffy's X, bro. Or Luffy's scar. Haha, <laughs> what's good with it, bitch? Aha, all right. We're gonna get the off-white chisane for the X. This is actually going to help us a lot when we get into the buttons. Let's find a yellow belt. Because the... I feel like what's hard is going to be the shirt and the, um... This waistband. I'm not gonna do the... I don't think I'm gonna do the scarf look to it. I don't like how this looks. Let's do... Let's go on Grail. Let's save a little money. Men's red. Mmm... Let's do this as if I was gonna wear it. Let's get this accurate. Men's three quarter sleeve red shirt. It needs to open up. Or what we could do... What's the call with like... Sh uh, shirt, no collar, with buttons. <laughs> I don't know, what the fuck is this called? Like a Henley? No collar dress shirt. Is that what it is? I'm not wearing a fucking dress shirt in Jell-O, bro. Collarless button down, that's what we want. Collarless button down. Cause here's what I'm thinking. If we could, um, frilly sleeves. <laughs> right, cause like, see how Luffy has this on the side? If we could get this somehow onto it like this, on like a very fucking, cause all we, we would really need to do is get the ends. You know what I mean? And then as long as we can get that cuff, sew it onto the fucking shirt, whether that looks good or whether it doesn't, you know what I mean? That would be kind of lit. Um, and this will be in a, if we could get this in like a red chiffon. There, yeah, easy. Now let's get one of those and then we'll cut that up. And I think we're good. Uh, men's blue shorts. Are we going short shorts or are we going long shorts in this bitch? Yeah, because what we could do is... I'd say... Mm, nah, let's just get a belly chain, bro. Instead of this sash, let's just get a belly chain. And then we'll put like a straw hat on it. Yeah, belly chain, straw hat. Uh, uh, let's, let's just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll just get a belly chain. Easy. Let's get this one. And then we'll get a, a, a one piece charm. Straw hat charm. God damn it. Straw hat. I have to pee one piece charm. I want like a fucking. I want some. Oh no, we could totally do this. Yeah. I want metal. This one. There we go. That way we can just break off this part and then we can hang this off the chain. No problem. Uh, da -da 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 -da. That's too expensive. Let me get a cheaper one. I'm not gonna pay $30 for something I'm gonna wear once. Belly chain. Probably only use this, uh, I like the first one rather than, ah, I do like pearls. I don't know, we'll use that. And then we'll hang like a little fucking, we'll hang the, the fucking, the Mugiwara right through the middle, right there. That'd be kind of lit, dude. That'd be kind of sick, I like that. I like that idea a lot. And then, um, like I said about lines, so the, uh, the uh, off-white chain's going to form another line that connects down to the belly belly chain with the Mugiwara. Yeah, dude. Oh, that's kind of lit, actually. And then fuck it. Let's just put some. Let's just put some jean shorts. Let's keep it. Let's keep it simple. You know what I'm saying? Let's keep it simple. We could go jean shorts, or we could go um, white, blue men's shorts. We gotta go five inches. Five inch. Five inch where it's at, especially at this at this heat, bro. Blue. I would want a white accent on it. An accent is like whatever little shit that's on it <laughs> would be an accent. Like the way this uh, uh, fucking Under Armour logo is, that would be a white accent. Shit like that. Like maybe you have white shoes with red laces. That would be a red accent. You know what I mean? Whatever 
secondary fucking color. And then again, I don't know what the fucking words are, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, this would be lit. This would be lit if it was less stripes. You know what I mean? All blue on top. Blue. I'm just gonna go on Amazon for it. Blue men's five inch straight ass, bro. Like literally. And we don't want laces because we already got something there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we don't want laces because that's gonna fuck with our lines that we talked about. Those horizontal lines that we're getting from the belly, uh, the belly necklace, the belly. What's it got? Belly chain. You know, we don't want that shit. We don't want them lines. You could always tuck them in, but still. I feel like I liked one earlier. It doesn't hurt to buy something for your fit that you're actually gonna wear later. So, let me get this one. Just cause I would use this after. Oh no. God damn it. I had a pee hella bad, bro. Or, mmm, that's not a bad idea. Cause if we go... Wait, no, I'm stupid. It has to be fucking... It has to be fucking jean shorts. Look at him, he's wearing jean shorts. Jean shorts with white trim. It's called a trim, right? Jean shorts with white trim. What is a trim? <laughs> white cuffs. That's actually perfect right here. Yeah, we can just roll it up. I'm, I'm doing too... I'm doing too much. I'm doing way too much. Men's five inch jean shorts. Gross. <laughs> oh, this one has elastic? Bro, say less, buddy. Let's get some... These aren't jeans, but I mean, it's good enough. Ass! Can you put your ass away? That's so much ass! <laughs> there we go. Some Wragglers. Give it a little baggy look. You know what I mean? We don't gotta... We ain't, oh, that's, that's actually fucking damn near perfect. Let's get this in a 34. Perfect! Yeah. Oh damn, these are cargo. Uh, because of these, you can't roll them up. It's not the biggest deal, but it's not the look I'm going for. I don't want a cargo short in it, or I don't want that uh, utility shit in it. How are you looking? There we go. You can just do some Levi's. It's not a big deal. All right. Looks like we got our fit, people. Oh, we don't have a shirt yet. Shirt, 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 shirt. Red collarless. Button up. <laughs> Let me see if we can get this in uh, Amazon. Uh, red silk shirt. Collarless. Women's. I said collarless! I said no collars! Oh, this would be cool. But I need buttons. I mean, technically, you could just put a cardigan on this bitch and you're good. But, yeah, like something like... That's actually perfect. What is this called? Ooh, a silk button up? Red collarless silk button up. Ooh! Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, no, this is what I'm, this is what I'm looking for. This one right here. Or... I mean, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, don't be afraid to fucking go into the girl section if you're, or in the woman section if you aren't, um, if you don't wear women section clothes, I don't know the right way to say it, but yeah man, just whatever fits fits, fuck it, who cares. Alright, let's start this from the bottom up, I won't do the Gucci's in this, cause, fuck it. <laughs> and then for the shirt, the shit I was looking at, go back already? Son of a bitch. Collarless. We're for sure going with silk, bro. Here's the one I liked. Did I lose it? Fuck. <laughs> That's some shit. That shit happens though. It's all good. I ain't tripping. Oh man. Those other ones were damn near perfect though. Oh. Found it, boy. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this is all Luffy's jacket. What the fuck? Alright. It's all my size, but for argument's sake. So, let's start it from the- we'll go from the top down. Alright, cool. So we're gonna dye our hair blonde, we're gonna get this white chiffon sash. 
and then our scarf or head wrap, whatever you want to call it. And then we're going to write, draw those fucking clouds onto it, right? So we get that appeal. We could just drape it over our shoulders. When you drape it, you see how it's like right across the neck right here? You might want to give it a little extra space so it hangs. And then when the wind blows down there, you remember, like we said, remember we looked at the fucking weather. We're going to be getting a gentle breeze. So imagine that scarf blowing in the wind. You get a little piece all around. You could be getting those clouds like Luffy's Gear 5. That's kind of sick. Um, yeah, man. So, uh, and then we're going to get, get it down to this shirt that we somehow found. This is pretty cool. This is like 90s Chinese mom fucking shirt. But, you know, it's all... <laughs> Never made the connection. I always knew Luffy's shirt looked fucking familiar. Anyway, so we're gonna get that. We're gonna go a little bit down, and then we're gonna get this um, this belly chain. Uh, so we we're gonna use this instead of that that uh, yellow sash that Luffy wears around his waist. Personally, I never I didn't like that in the when we get into the new world. You know, I didn't like how it looked, but it's cool. It does like maybe the idea was to match up with the linings that we the line that that Straw Hat gave him. So it gives us another line against the head and then you know, matching the sash right there. Anyways, um, yeah, dude. I mean, everything looks different when you when you put it on, but um, yeah, man, I've, the idea of this gets me real hyped and that's a good sign. Uh, we're gonna get some regular ass jean shorts. We're just gonna roll them up so we can get this white cuff that Luffy has. We ain't gotta do fur, fucking. This ain't fucking Fanime, or this ain't Anime Expo, like, we ain't gotta go that hard on that thing, just do what you like. I ain't trying to wear fucking fur and fluffy shit at Cella, it's a goddamn desert. And then we're gonna get some Burks. Or, if we were trying to flex up a little bit, we're gonna get the Gucci's. <laughs> yeah, man, but on and off, oh, and uh, for this X, we're gonna get Luffy's scar, we're gonna be rocking uh, an off-white chain, bruh. And the whole thing should be... We could find a cheaper version of this shirt, but let's see. This is gonna be, let's say, twelve dollars. I want to spend. I want to cut it at twenty dollars. So like, 30, let's say we're at thirty-two dollars. Uh, fucking keychain. Can also make this, but uh, let's say we pay for it. We're at forty dollars. Get the chain. Another eight, nine dollars. Just bump it up to fifty. I have jean shorts already, so. But for argument's sake, we're at seventy-five, and then. Yeah, about, about 200 bucks. Yeah, about 175 to 200 bucks, but the bulk of that's going to be coming from these Birkenstocks. If you have Birkenstocks already, and also Birkenstocks are just a good investment. You're not gonna only use this for Cella. And for the type of, um, you're walking miles when you're at Cella. Like, be prepared for a lot of footwork. So Birkenstocks will be a good fucking, like, a, it'll just be a good move for you, for your feet, for the sake of your fucking posture. You're gonna be standing a lot and walking a lot and jumping and running a lot, bro. Like, so you might as well get something comfy. So that $99 investment is gonna bump up the price, but this is gonna be a long-term thing. You can use these Birkenstocks for different things. Or we go straight $700 and get the Gucci ones. You know what I mean? So yeah, man, like we can do budget versions of this and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, man, I mean, that would be the fit. That would be my day one fit for, uh, for Cella. Who would we see in this fit? So, yeah, man, so what are we saying? We're gonna see, if we wore this in day one, we would go see Big Sean, Harry Styles, Lil Baby, Daniel Caesar. Who else do I wanna see here? Nikki? I'd see Nikki. I see pink sweats in this fit. That's pretty fun. Uh, da 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 da. Cord Corday? Mmm. I don't know if that's how I say it, but I'd definitely see him in this fit. Um, fucking Ravina? Bro, I just, I got into Ravina by accident, bro. Ravina's dope as shit. I'd see her in this fit. Code Orange. Chats, Night Owls. Sick, man. No, I really like this. Y'all let me know if you like this type of content, bro. Like, I wanna, I'll wanna do this for more festivals. Maybe I'll, I don't know, I'll do like a prom one. I don't know, some shit. I just like clothes, man. And if people want advice and shit, ask me check out my discord where uh there is a sec a certain section for these um fashion tips and shit and um i also want to like leave it open for like hey uh, my buddy has a brand that's popping off here put it there i want like resellers a place for resellers to come through um what else i want on discord i want an, i have a hr section where you could just fucking complain about work 
And uh, yeah, because like you don't always have the option to complain to HR one because maybe you don't have an HR rep two maybe or you don't have an HR department maybe it's all run by the supervisor but you don't want to talk about your supervisor talk shit about your supervisor to your supervisor you know what I mean so I want to just leave that out there for a for a um, for a um, what's the word for an outlet you know free for don't say anything fucked up to each other period. Uh, please play, please buy tickets to my uh, my first uh, my comedy special on May twelfth. Uh, it's called a family film. Uh, all the mo proceeds from ticket sales will be going to uh, uh, proceeds from ticket sales will be going to the LGBT community. Um, yeah, man, I'm gonna be talking about sex, drugs, sexuality. I'm gonna be fucking with the church. I'm gonna be talking about anime. I'm gonna be talking about Marvel. I'm gonna be talking about everything you I am as a person is going to be in this show. If you, it's gonna be at uh, the Billy DeFrank Center in uh, San Jose, California. If you know where the SAP is, where the Sharks play, it's like down the street, less than two miles away from that. Uh, if you're not in the area or you can't happen to make it physically, there will be a live stream link for you, a YouTube live stream link, uh, given to you on the day of. Uh, that's gonna be free. And there will be a bunch of other um, opportunities to to donate through that. Uh, please support Black, Brown, Asian business. Y'all have a wonderful weekend. My name is Kyle from work. Thank you so much for joining. Peace.